Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So I'll be leaving for a short one week holiday to Vietnam very soon and I thought it'd be fun to do a little get ready with me video showing you guys what I'm bringing along. I'll be visiting Ho Chi Minh City and Da Nang but the itinerary is not really finalized yet so I may change a few things in my outfits. But for now, this is roughly what I'm going to be bringing. Ho Chi Minh City is rather hot and humid while Da Nang is slightly cooler so I think I'll have some fun with that. So one of the shirts I'll be bringing is this blue Follow Your Dream shirt from Wild Blue Denim and this was from my October to November haul video if you remember. So this one's really soft and lightweight so I feel like this is going to be great for the weather over there. And to go with this shirt, I'll be bringing along a pair of white high-waisted shorts from Delia's because this will be an easy match with this shirt since there's a bunch of whites going on in the shirt. The next shirt is this alien patch ring a tee from my store and I thought this was just really cute because aliens are so trendy all year round and I have one over here too. So yeah, this will make a really cute and fun outfit for a casual day out and to go with this, I'm bringing along my Levi's shorts that I DIY'd in my previous videos so you can go check that out to see how I made these. And to go along with these Levi's shorts, I'm bringing along my adidas t-shirt as well and this one's got a nice golden foil going on so I think this is really pretty to wear and since it's so hot and summery over there I should bring a strappy tank top so this one's really versatile and easy to style you can just wear some shorts with it and a jacket over if it's too cold and that is a great outfit already then I'll be bringing this striped t-shirt dress from my store and because t-shirt dresses are so easy to throw on and make an outfit and I think I'll be wearing this for Danang because I plan on styling it with this denim blouse from American Apparel so I can just tie this around the waist and if it gets too cold I can throw it on. I'm pretty sure I'm overpacking but I'm going to bring this okay sweater just in case it gets cold and it is slightly cropped so it's not too bad and I can wear it with shorts so it's not too warm as well. And I think it is essential to bring along a pair of jeans so I'm bringing this blue coloured high waisted jeans from Tally Wage. And I am in love with how this one fits on me and it is not very thick so I think this will be perfect. And finally I have this pink bomber jacket with lots of patches and you can find this on my store as well. Patch bomber jackets are so cute so I thought of bringing along one and why not in pink because pink is my favourite colour. And this one's not very thick so it's great for just keeping the wind out and keeping you feeling just right. I'm not sure how often we'll be going swimming and going to the beach but I'm pretty sure there's a private pool and beach at the hotels so I'm bringing a few bikinis and so the first one over here is this black strappy bikini so it's got the halter neckline over here and a little strappy detail over here and I like this because it's going crisscross and crisscross designs are my favourite and the bikini bottoms have some cutouts as well so yeah this is really very cute and the next one i have over here is this stripey halter kind of bikini and since it is more covered up i'm planning to wear it in danang where it's colder in case we go to the beach or something and to go with this i have these bikini bottoms from triangle and the material is really really soft and spongy so it's very comfortable to wear and this color is just so pretty so I think both of them would look great together. And if it's really sunny, I plan on wearing this floral bikini bandeau kind of top. And there's actually a neck strap over here so that it doesn't fall, so I think that's great. And the matching bikini bottoms look like this. For footwear, I'll be bringing these Unicorn Superstars which have actually been restocked at a few places so you can go check them out if you have been wanting to get these. These are really versatile and they are very easy to match since they have a lot of colours going on in the shoe. So you can match them with blue, pink, purple, yellow, white, black, you know, basically everything. And you can't forget flip-flops since I'm going to the beach and I have these brand new pair of Billabong slippers and they are just in black and pink. I don't think I'll be bringing a lot of makeup, just, you know, light, natural, everyday stuff. So I like to put my toiletries and makeup in this Sephora makeup bag because it's quite big and slightly transparent so you can see everything you've got inside. So for face makeup, I have this ZA BB cream and this provides full coverage for me plus there is 
SPF of 43 so that will definitely protect me from the sun. So this would be really good to wear every day since it will cover up all my imperfections and provide sunscreen protection. And then I have my trusty liquid eyeliner from Heroin Make. So this is what I use on my eyes all the time so I definitely have to bring it. And then I have my eyelash curler over here from e.l.f. Cosmetics and my mascara from Makeup Forever. So this one really coats my eyelashes really well and gives me lots of volume and length. So this would be good for a little bit of extra stuff on my eyes. And for brows, I have this brown eyebrow pencil from Forever 21 and the makeup is not fantastic. I would not recommend it at all but I have to finish using this one up and this does a pretty decent job on me but for the price range, you might as well buy some Colourpop. And since I don't think I'll be wearing eyeshadow, I think I'll be keeping my lips simple as well. So I'll be bringing this Colourpop lippy stick in the colour Cami. And this is a very nice rose pink colour which I think would be perfect for everyday use. And in case that gets too drying, I have this sample sized Urban Decay lip gloss. And this is just a very sheer, nudie kind of lip gloss. It doesn't give any colour to the lips but it does help moisturise it. Plus it's so tiny, isn't it cute? You can just throw it in your purse and bring it everywhere. This is only 1.35ml or 0.04 ounces, so it is a pretty decent amount actually. And to remove all that nasty stuff, I have this makeup remover from Maybelline and this is their eye plus lip makeup remover in a travel size bottle. And this is 40ml or 1.411 ounces. So this is really compact and easy to bring along and it actually works pretty well. So as long as it helps to remove my eyeliner and mascara, I'm really happy. My hair gets oily pretty fast so I'll be bringing my Batista dry shampoo and this is the travel size bottle. And this is a floral fragrance. I haven't really tried this scent out yet, but I hope it's nice and usually the scents are really nice, so I have no doubt that this would be great. My hair ends are really dry, so I like to use this essential hair serum to make it a bit more manageable and moisturized. And I haven't really transferred my shampoo and facial cleanser into a travel size bottle yet, so moving on we have this Bath & Body Works shower gel in Brazil Citrus. So this one really smells really fresh and summery, which I think is great for the weather over there. And to wrap up everything, the last item I have over here is this Bath & Body Works lotion and this is in the scent Twisted Peppermint. Now this one leaves a slightly cool feeling after applying, so I think it would be great if you have a sunburn and you apply this after a shower because it helps to cool the burned areas and it's just a great feeling. So that is basically it. I might change a few things here and there, but I hope you enjoyed this video anyway, and I'll see you after my trip. Bye-bye!